It's vacation finally. You can buy a ticket to an unforgettable island full of entertainment. The helicopter takes you there. Unfortunately, you won't be able to relax much because you need to solve puzzles in addition to having fun. And at the end of the video, count how well you went through it. You're going to have fun all day. Challenging riddles require concentration and attention, but you want to solve them in a relaxed way this time. Enjoy! The first thing you do is go to a beach party. Sun, ocean, hot, white sand. You take a soda and go dancing. All of a sudden, the music stops. You ask the DJ what happened. Someone pulled the wire from the speakers, she says. You go behind the stage and see five chords. All of them have different colors. Two of them need to be inserted into the speakers. Which ones? Hurry up, save the party! Red and green. There are marks with corresponding colors in the left corner of each speaker. The party goes on. You're tired and hungry, so you go to a restaurant. There's a huge buffet with hot dishes. You take two sandwiches and sit down at the table. After a delicious meal, you decide to have some fresh fruit for dessert. You come up to the table with bananas, apples, pineapples, and kiwis. Some of these fruits are not fresh. Which of them, and why is that? All the fruit trays are almost empty, but there are a lot of kiwis left. People don't take them since they're not very fresh. After lunch, you go to the beach. The sand is so hot that you can fry eggs on it, so you put on your shoes. You see a group of people playing volleyball. You want to join them, get closer, but the game field is empty. Was it a mirage, or did the people leave the spot so quickly that you didn't notice? What do you think? It was a mirage, since there are no footprints in the sand. The sun is hot, and you decide to go into the jungle to hide in the shadows. You go out into a wide clearing and see several people sitting in the lotus position. It's a meditation session. People relax with their eyes closed and do not see that you've come. You carefully sit down next to them and realize that something is wrong with all these people. What is it exactly? They don't just sit, they're floating a couple inches off the ground. Who are they? You get scared and run away from this place. You run through the jungle and see three roads. One is littered with broken glass. There are plants with thorns on the second road, and you see hot coals on the third one. Which one will you choose? Actually, you can go everywhere. You put on your shoes on the beach, remember? In the very center of the island, you find a big old house. Its roof is destroyed and the windows are broken. But there's music coming from the building. You look inside and see a group of people in raincoats dancing to techno. You join the party and notice that each person has long fangs peeking out of their mouth. The dancers turn to you and look unfriendly. At first, you get scared, but then you realize these people are only pretending to be vampires. Fangs and cloaks are part of the masquerade. How do you know they're not vampires? The roof of the building is destroyed. The sunlight gets inside. The vampires should be afraid of it. You keep dancing, and at that moment, you get terrified. The dancers aren't vampires, but they're not humans either. Why do you think so? There's a mirror on the wall, and only you are reflected in it. You run out of the building and go through the jungle. White pigeons fly past you, and in the distance you can hear people's voices. You make your way through the bushes and find yourself at a wedding ceremony. People are sitting on the chairs. A bride, a groom, his friend, and two bridesmaids are standing in front. Everything seems fine, but then you realize that one of these people is an alien. Who? The 
the bride. You can see that she has three hands. It doesn't scare you too much. After the ceremony, the party begins. You speak with the guests, take drinks and snacks. An old man gets on the stage to deliver a speech. He says that he has a gift to the newlyweds, an elixir that makes a person younger by five years and prolongs life. The same elixir is inside every drink, and everyone can drink it. All the guests rush to the table and grab glasses. Someone drinks two glasses at once. Someone five to six glasses in a row. Someone quickly drinks only one. And among all the people, there is an old lady. She slowly drinks her cocktail and becomes a little younger. Why did the elixir affect her, but not the other guests? The elixir was in ice cubes. The old lady drank for a long time, and the ice in the glass had time to melt. You leave the party and continue exploring the island. Ahead, you can see a tunnel with a warning sign. Beware the phantom inside. A guy and a girl come up with you. They offer to run through the tunnel to check if there are really ghosts there. So it won't be scary, you all run holding hands with each other. The girl is in the middle. It's cold and slippery inside the tunnel. You can't hear anything. You're approaching the exit and finally got out. It was a little scary, you say. It's good that I was in the middle, said the girl. Me too, I wasn't afraid, says the guy. At this point, you realize there was a phantom inside the tunnel. How did you figure that out? Three people ran through the tunnel, and only one could be in the middle, the girl. Whose hand was the guy holding? You get scared and leave this place. Oh. Evening. You go back to the hotel and see that it's on fire. There's a fire on your floor. You run inside. Fire is everywhere. You have two valuable things that you want to take away. A small safe with documents and money and a laptop with your work. You need to choose one thing. Take the computer. Most safes can withstand high temperatures, but a laptop is unlikely. You can find your safe after the fire. You've got a different room on the 10th floor. It's spacious with an ocean view. You're about to go to bed, but someone is knocking on the door. It's the administrator. She says there's a snake in your room, but you need to find it. Look around and find the reptile. Do you see those beaded curtains behind the second room? Among the beads, you can notice the outline of a snake. You release the snake into the jungle, return to your hotel, and notice footprints on the parquet floor. Oh. Someone was here and wanted to steal something. You call the administrator and tell her what happened. She has already found three suspects, and you need to guess which one of them broke into the room. There are two guys wearing shoes and a barefoot girl. Who will you choose? The girl couldn't leave these footprints. The guy who's standing next to her has soaking wet clothes on. His feet are also wet, but he has put on his sandals to hide them. The footprints in the room were wet. The second guy's clothes are dry. The girl's clothes are dry too, which means the guy wearing wet clothes got into your room. You can't fall asleep in the new room. It's already 3 a.m. and you decide to take a walk on the beach. Suddenly, you hear some noise. A beautiful girl is standing outside the window. She's smiling and looking at you. <laughs> at first, you smile back, but then you pick up your stuff and quickly run out of the room. You call the administrator and say that you won't stay in this hotel any longer. Why did you do that? Your room is on the 10th floor. The girl looked at you outside the window and you got scared. You can't sleep until morning and decide to leave this island. You sit on the sand and wait. A helicopter arrives and lowers a rope ladder. You're about to climb it, but at this moment, another helicopter arrives. It has the same rope ladder too. Now you need to choose the right helicopter.
Take a closer look at the pilot of the first helicopter. It's an alien. You get into the second helicopter and fly away. The first one turned out to be a spaceship. Your vacation has come to an end, which means it's time to see what you've achieved. Zero to four points. Try to solve more logic puzzles and you'll be able to do better. Or maybe you just decided not to strain yourself too much and relax on this vacation. Five to eight points. Not bad. The party and the celebration atmosphere didn't dull your attentiveness and resourcefulness. But you can do better. Nine to 12 points. You were able to relax because you not only had fun, but also trained your brain. 13 to 15 points. You can quickly solve logic riddles and find a way out of any problematic situation. But don't forget to rest and relax your mind.